Right now, a celebration underway in Conway and across the Palmetto State after Coastal Carolina won its first ever national championship. They beat Arizona in the winner-take-all Game 3 of the College World Series. Sports Director Evan West joins us with more. Evan, it got interesting late. Your sports office was full of people watching this game. It was very interesting. Yeah, the Shans actually planned a parade today, but lightning struck those plans down, postponing last night's scheduled primetime matchup to this afternoon. But with all the success the Shans have tasted during their 11-day trip in Omaha, they didn't mind staying another night. Trying to win their first ever national championship in program history, Andrew Beckwith pretty good on the mound. It was a pitcher's duel through five innings. Scoreless in the top of the six. Cody Raymer can't handle the routine grounder. His throw to third off base. Two runs come in to score, and the Shants take a 2-0 lead. Right, next batter up is G.K. Young, and there is no J.K. about G.K.'s power. He crushes it to right field, a two-run shot, and the Carolina Shana clears. Jump ahead 4-0. Back come the Cats. In the ninth inning, it's 4-2. Zach Gibbons lifts one to center field. The sack fly sends home another run. It's 4-3 now. All Coastal needs just one out. Ryan Aguilar, the next man up. Alex Cunningham can bring it on the mound, but Aguilar serves it right back. A shot to the wall in left field. It's barely fair, but the runner holds up at third. The tying man on third base. Just look how close it was to being foul. Man, it was that close. All right. The winning run on second, uh, it brings up Salazar. He rings up a full count, but Cunningham gets him swinging. Coastal Carolina wins the national championship. 4-3, to three, the final score. Their first in school history. We'll have reaction from the newly crowned champs coming up at 6 o'clock in sports.